I'm standing pretty much in exactly the same spot where I fell in love for the first time. Hey, I'm Sergey from Newhouse Team in Penticton, and I'm not talking about falling in love with my beautiful wife, Laura. I'm talking about my absolutely amazing, beautiful Okanagan. When I was picked up in the car by my family member in April of 2012, and we drove from the airport to Penticton, we were driving along the lake, where 97 is Peachland, and then we hit up and came up onto Four Lane Highway, which you can hear behind me, and the valley opened up in front of me, and my heart was stolen for the second time. Take a look, how can you not be absolutely stunned with scenery like this? Gorgeous Okanagan Lake, beautiful vineyards, and then those beautiful hills on both sides of Lake Okanagan. So, I am actually coming from, I've been driving since three in the morning, coming from uh, Calgary and Lake Louise, where we had a mastermind for three days with some of the top agents across North America, from Nebraska, Oklahoma, Toronto, Calgary. There were team leaders and operators who have done in the last 12 months, 946 transactions, 1,274, 1,800 transactions in 12 months, and there was one operator whose team did 3,000 transactions in 12 months. Now. The beautiful part about that is that not only we are becoming better business operators, better real estate agents to serve our clients, but we also that kind of training that I, I was part of, was, it was a privilege to be in those rooms, we were also becoming human beings because it's all about how you can understand, relate to humans and actually serve them better. And that's the only place that a good strong service provider should operate from from the heart and I'm so thrilled and I'm so pleased that I can honestly say that every single person on our team has that operating principles now fun part was that when I was actually in Lake Louise with those operators and we were climbing we had a day hike and they're half a day six hours seven hour hike we climbed up to the top of Lake Louise where I think it was Devil's Thumb or something like that the, the, the peak of one of the mountains and we look down it was absolutely gorgeous those people their jaws were dropped because in Nebraska and Oklahoma you don't see stuff like that but inside inside I was kind of giggling like a little kid and, and I knew that I'm not really amazed because I know I live in that look at this behind me this is my Lake Louise and this is just as gorgeous, just as beautiful. And I have a privilege to live here every single day and I love it. Now, how does it relate to you? Now, if you are getting a little closer to pulling a trigger and moving to this area, you need to reach out to us so we can share with you the good, the bad, and the ugly. That's what we bring as value to people we work with. We tell you everything. We're experts in the South Okanagan market, real estate marketplace, and we're here to get to know it, understand that, and then hopefully take you a few steps further to help you find the home just like we did in 2012. Now, quick update for sellers. Marketplace, I think you'll have a strong market for the next 45 days. August is gonna be dead, so you either don't list, so you're not hitting August market, or and you wait till September, October, which typically are strong. September, October has very strong markets uh, in the past, and I suspect it's gonna be again. August is gonna be dead. It's like the second January all over the place, all over again in the Groundhog Day in the second, <laughs> second time in the year. So buyers, I think you still have a few opportunities there because we, uh, we have a little bit of higher listing inventory and therefore sellers are a little bit more flexible. So therefore, you know, you have some strength in, in, in your hands and some power to negotiate. In general, I suspect market in, in, in South Okanagan is going to have a, a relatively good trajectory upwards. And why? Because we had a, at that same mastermind, we had a listing presentation by a mortgage broker who, who owns brokerages across Canada. And she shared some stats with us. And it's the stats that I'm aware of, which are low listing inventory in the areas. We have 5, 500,000 immigrants planned to be, um, you know, coming to, to the area for, for the next five years. Every year, half a million new people to, to North America, to, to Canada. That is craziness. We have still very tedious and long process to obtain permits for constructions, especially in South Okanagan. We're a landlocked between two lakes. We can't build a lot of inventory, so therefore it's a problem for us to get extra inventory. And then, take a, 
Take a listen to this crazy wild statistics. Right now, open permits and job sites. You can well guess how many contractors and job site workers are per job site right now, where the permits are open and construction is going. Half a person. Yes, not one, not one and a half, not two. Half a person. That is craziness. So, job, jobs are strong. Low inventory is here, so the market is gonna stay strong. I believe that, you know what? Something could happen, of course, I don't have a crystal ball, but I suspect that we're gonna see some value appreciation. Guys, I hope this information was helpful for you. If you need anything about South Okanagan real estate, reach out to Newhouse team, we'll look after you. Enjoy, peace.